guys. Uh, what's up, YouTube? So, um, we're still waiting on components for our solar system. So we're going to start just, um, working on some small little projects that's been bothering us. And one of them is this. Um, edit bothering her. <laughs> Haven't been bothering me. Well, anyway, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> I'm the co-pilot, so I'm the one that has to make sure everything's secure when we're driving down the road. But um, our little um, end table back here is not bolted down to the floor or anything. And um, so we're going to address that today. We're going to bolt it down and fix it so the drawer won't open anymore when we're traveling down the road. So that little guy right there is what we're going to address today. What we're going to try to do is we're going to put one of these things in that bottom style and it, <coughs> that will uh, allow her to use the thumb screw thing. Oh, like what we're using on the kitchen cabinet? Yeah, so my idea is to try to keep all of these things as uniform as possible so if the same bolts worked everywhere it would be really slick. All right, that was super easy to take that off. So we just took the top off. All right. Now we can just clamp this guy where we want it. Oh, I hope that's in the right place. <laughs> the second thing I hope is that I hope this wood that's being particle board is strong enough to hold this. It's got a little bit of a bevel on this side for starting the screw so it'll be easier to put it in the other way but it's not going to be that hard to put in anyhow. Oh it's cracking. It's not cracking it's it's stretching. Mm. Maybe your sharpies will fill that in. Well, that's the only discerning part is that little flake right there. Uh, There's a thick one in there. Yeah. Yeah, yesterday she made me take all my Sharpies back to the main bag. I always kept one in the bus. And I was afraid of that. Sharpies are a great little trick. I don't know if it'll cover there, it might not. You have to blend it, see? Look at that. Mm. It's like now it has mm. texture. Okay. Operation hole in my particle board is complete. Should we put a, we should put a hole in there for it to screw into, huh? Yeah, because it's, it's bending the, bending that thing. Bending there. that brace, that bar, and. I'm making, not gonna hear the end of this. He's making me nervous. Oh, there you go, baby. Yeah, now it's not pulling it apart or anything. Well, perfect. Yep, that'll work. <sighs> Seriously, YouTube. That's the vents for the diesel heater right there, and I tried to point them away from me, and it's on idle, but that thing is cooking me, so I gotta turn it off. But we are loving our diesel heater, huh? That thing is amazing, but... Not when you're working right here. Now we're gonna use the Craigie thing. The Craig jig. All right, so we're putting a shout out to Gilligan Phantom who said, he showed how he screwed the furniture down. We're gonna copy that, it's a great idea. So thanks for putting that on your, on your videos. Yeah, so we're gonna get the jig set up and we're just gonna put pocket holes on all four corners of this. Oh, it's an inch and a half. 
Okay, YouTube, Shelly does a lot of off-camera engineering. When, she, when, she's, when the camera's not on, she's very vocal about what's going on. Anyways, this ain't going to work. So we'll set it to an inch and a half. The measurements are back here. That thing comes off easily out of your way. Push the buttons and... Yeah, there we go. That's set for an inch and a half. Yeah, now we can just... Hopefully those are down far enough. Gotta, oh, there it goes on. That's how that goes, right? So that'll, that'll clamp right on there. My original bit got dull. So when I got the new one, it's got the measurements right on there. Check that out. See that little window? And like right there, it says inch and a half, and that's what we're doing. So I put that at inch and a half. And that's your stop. I think it would be prudent that we tested this out before we did it on, the, on that. <laughs> Well, let's see. So that looks good. I think this is going to be it, baby. That should do it. I think so. That's all we got to do is go through that plywood over there. Oh, that is three quarter inch plywood. Uh-huh. Uh, we should go down another quarter of an inch. It's short. But the other thing you're not thinking about is you're going to have another three-eighths of flooring on top of there later. Oh, that's true. Yeah. So, so we do need to go down a little bit more. We'll just go a quarter of an inch more. So all we got to do is put that one right in the middle. We and, uh, sure have enjoyed this crate jig, huh? Got her in position and now we're gonna lock her down. Well, with that particle board, if you pulled the trigger on this, you'd come out in the underbay. <laughs> Deal. She ain't gonna go nowhere. You can lock the drawer. And then when you're home, you can just take this guy out. Okay, okay. that job's done. Sweet. Now yeah, we can go do the same thing to the bathroom vanity because it's not anchored down either. All right, people. Shelly's finally doing her part. <laughs> Listen to him, YouTube. <laughs> like she's I been off camera engineering this. You guys have no idea. She's been off camera. Are you sure you want to do that? You sure you want to color them like that? Yeah, we're going to fill them in with the black Sharpie. You got to love Sharpies, man. What do you mean, oh shoot? I came off the board. What? I came off the board. <laughs> you messed up? No. I just gave it some personality. <laughs> the awesome part about the jig, this little jig is you can take that vice grip off and just clamp it on with other style clamps and you can really adjust this to do anything that you want so I'm now using that longer screw so I got more meat on this one I went a little bit shallow on the table up there I'm, I think it'll be fine but uh, by adjusting this collar and adjusting this where you want the hole you can go outside of their set standards and make it be just the way you want I wish I would have had this thing like 30 years ago man yeah now you need some blue sharpie I wonder how you're gonna match that color you could blend them, you could put some blue and black. This thing has never tried to move, so, but this is such a great idea that Gilligan Phantom had, because now I can just take those things out when I put the flooring down, put the flooring underneath it, put it right back down. 
it's totally awesome. It is. It so is. So it's a great deal. It's a great. It's good to have these off of our list. We, so we did stick a latch up here for yeah. locking the medicine cabinet down. So, right. so that's all secure. So what else is moving around? What else is? On I think the that's about it. That's really moving around in the bus. So I think we've got it pretty well locked up. Those were the last couple little things that I was having to. Yeah, we still happen to put blocks and screws on the doors. But yeah, we but gotta work. That's down the road. That's a cosmetic thing. So, yeah. so anyway, we're gonna um, end the video here and know that we love sharing the journey with you guys, and we will just catch you in the next one. Love to you all. Bye.